Alright guys, welcome back to a brand new PDCGO Celestial Storm video, and today guys, we're going to be opening up 66 locked Celestial Storm packs, and uh, we'll see what we can pull, hopefully we can get Rayquaza GX, and uh, we'll have to see if we end up pulling that many GXs. I swear though, for some reason, the, the pull rate in the locked packs is not that great, but we'll see what we can do, hopefully we get a good pack opening video here, and hopefully... Things go well. So in the first pack, we do get a Reverse Hall Shuppet. That will go well in a Bayonet deck. And we get a Deoxys... No, sorry, there's a Bug flying around my face. We get a Deoxys Speed Form, I think. This is Speed Form. Not a bad pack, I guess. We do have a Gorbis, which I think is actually somewhat decent. And we also got the new Voltorb. So, not a bad pack. We'll go to the second pack straight away, see what we can find. Again, hopefully we can get some good GXs. Ah, sorry about that. I need a drink of water. And, uh, alright. We got a Claydol and a bunch of other just stuff. Claydol is interesting. Miraculous Spin could be, like, a fun deck with, like, Bikini and Steven's Resolve. In it, like, it would have to work in Expanded, though. Um, so let's see what we get in this next pack here. We are three packs in. We got a Versal Gulp, and we do get a Taint Liza, my first one. This is actually a really interesting card. And our rare is another Regis. So I pulled one earlier when I opened up a few unlocked packs. As long as Pokemon react to Pokemon, your Pokemon can't play any stadiums from their hand. It's an interesting ability. Obviously, it'll be better in Expanded than in Standard, because in Expanded, you can shut down Skyfield and D-Valley, but that's not going to matter because it's so weak. I don't think Regis is that great. But we do get the beautiful Mudkip. We got the beat-up Sneasel, which is pretty nice. I could... Maybe see like a fun little Sneasel deck do something, I doubt it. Alright, let's see if we can pull a GX here. Um, I would like to pull one. We do get a Reverse Hall Sableye and a Macargo. Alright, this is the best pack we've gotten so far. We got a lot of good things. We got a Hustle Belt. That's my first one. We got Last Chance Potion. We got the new Oracorio, which is actually really interesting. And we got Sableye. Sableye is a very good pull. This is a really cool card. And Macargo is always good too. So, we'll see what we get in our next pack here. Um, no GXs yet, which is a little annoying. Please, can we pull one? Um, Alright, we got our first Steven's Resolve, which isn't bad. We're going to need a couple of these. Probably at least three of them, if we're going to play Metagross. Um, we're also going to Metagross, too. So, <laughs> we'll see. Um, we do get an Onyx. We get a Beast Ball, which is pretty nice. Um, and our rare is another Red Jets. Wow, okay, so... Still no GXs, and um, we're, all, we're, we're, we're heading towards 10 packs in, so it's not the greatest. We do get the new Beldum, which is really good. Hopefully we get a play set of these by the end of the pack opening. And alright, first GX of the set is a Mr. Mine. Not the greatest GX in the world, it's actually pretty bad. Might be the worst GX in the set, only because like it's really easy to get past magic events and kind of work around that. We do get a Minior. Um, once you turn this to your active Pokemon, your bench is in full, you may move your active Pokemon to your bench and play this Pokemon as your active Pokemon. It's a really interesting ability, but it's not that great of a card. I don't know. Um, we do have Soul Rock, which is pretty interesting. The uh, maximum HP of your Loon Tone is 130, so to be things there. I think the big thing we got was probably the new C Dot and the new Beldum. I think the Beldum is probably the best card um, other than the Mr. Mind. So uh, we'll, at least we got a GX. Hopefully we can keep it up. Hopefully we can get a Rayquaza or two. We got a Copycat, Pokenap, and nope, no Prism Star in this pack. We do get the new Slack King. As long as Pokemon with your active Pokemon, your opponent's Pokemon in play have no abilities except Lazy. Okay, so this is a okay ability. Um, the nice thing about it is it can actually punish, you know, decks like Zoark and Malamar. Um, so it's not a terrible ability. I can definitely see Slack King be like a weird rogy deck. We'll have to look into slacking for sure. So we'll, we'll go to the next pack here. I need to get another drink of water. Oh, we got Mass Royale, which is a very interesting card. Attach basic energy to one of your stage twos from your hand. Um, and it ha Now you can attach it to Sceptile, Charizard, GX, Lazy, and GX, Swampert. It's an interesting card. We do get a Versal and Marsh Tomp, which is nice if I want to put Marsh Tomp in my deck. We got a Delmine, alright, um, the Fire Oracorio, um, alright, never mind, it's not that good, uh, alright, we are going into our next pack, so far only one GX, but we do have 66 packs, so, I'm, I'm feeling, I'm feeling okay, but if it gets down to it, and alright, I 
kind of predicted it last night when I was kind of just sitting, you know, watching other pack loaded videos on YouTube, like from Yellow Swallow. But I did not expect, well, no, I did expect, sorry, um, I expected to pull another Full Art Scissor for some reason. And look at that, now we got three Full Art Scissors. We did get a Hiker. Look at the top five cards of either player's deck, choose one of them, and that player shuffles those cards back to the deck. Wow. But, uh, alright, we got a Full Art Scissor again, so now we have three of them, so that's the thing. Alright, hopefully we can still get some other GXs, hopefully we get a Prism Star. Alright, we got Deoxys Defense Form. Which is, I mean, it's this is not a terrible card. I'm not saying it'll go into Malamar, but who knows. We do have a Grumpig. We got another Copycat. We got another Beat Up Sneasel. We got another Beltham, which is good. We'll go into our next pack here. Almost down to 50 packs. Um, so let's see what else we get. We got another Beltham. That's basically the same pack. Um, and an Alunatone and a Registeel. Registeel's not bad. Lunatone is okay if you have Sora can play fire pokemon to play have no abilities except gx and EXs. it's not the greatest ability um i think maybe when the new blaziken comes out this could see play you never know all right let's go to the next pack here hoping we can get another gx um, we'll see i'm really hoping we get a prism star we haven't gotten a prism star yet usually prism stars are more common than this so uh, yeah i'm looking at you looking at you laddie ass all right here we go. Are we gonna get a Prism Star? Nope. We do get we get a Reggie Rock and a Groudon in the same pack, so that's interesting. Um, now this is an interesting attack. Surprising pattern. Just got a little special energy from each of your opponent's Pokemon. That's very troll-like. Uh, but we do get our fourth block Beldum and we got a Sneasel. Um, but unfortunately, and no Prism Stars. So hopefully we can pull a few Prism Stars. So we're almost down to 50 packs left. And we'll see what we get here. We get a Reverse Hall Lunala and a Regirock. Lunala is an interesting card. I think it will be a nice one of in Lunala decks. Not bad. Uh, we do get a, another Clam Pearl. We got another Sableye. But no Prisms or GXs. So 51 packs left. So we'll see if we are able to get something good. We keep getting these locked cards. There we go. We got our Prism Star. And it's alright. Perfect. It's the best one we were hoping for. A Latias. Alright, nice. We got my boy Latias. We even got a Huntail, which is a really interesting card. And um, we got Grovile. We got more Tricos. Alright, that was a good pack. We got our first Prism Star, and it happens to be the one I was hoping for. So we'll see if we can get Latios too. Uh, maybe Jirachi. Alright, and we got, okay, Cartana's not bad. I'll take it. Um, it's an interesting card. It's going to be a little hard to kind of navigate. You kind of have to use this in the early game, um, and it can do at least 130 for two, but it's super fragile. We do get Lantern, which is an interesting card. When one of your Pokemon is knocked out from damage, you may move the basic energy from the Pokemon to this Pokemon. So it's got a built-in experience share. So if you put experience share on it, you get double energy attachments. It's not bad. Um, Dot Sparse is always nice. We got almost a full play set of the 70 HP Trico. All right, here we go. This is our 49th pack remaining. Too lazy to do the math. Um, we got Matang, we got another Steelix, and another Lunala. Alright, so Steelix isn't terrible. I'll take it. I do kind of like this. I'm going to try out a Steelix deck in the future, because I do think that Steelix is pretty interesting. It's uh, stage 1 with 190 HP. It's, it's pretty strong. Alright. We got Victory Bell, and our rare is Ludicolo. Ludicolo is always nice. It's not a bad card at all. And we got... Victory Bell, once during turn, you may flip a coin of heads, switch one of your opponent's bench with their active Pokemon. I mean, it's not a terrible ability. I doubt it'll see play, though. And we got our first bag on. That's a really nice artwork. Rockhead. Alright, um, got more 70 HP Mudkips. Alright, not bad. But, um, we're hoping for GXs. So we'll see what we get in this pack here. Alright, so we got Torchic, Reverse Hollow, and we got the new Sogaleo. Now, this is okay. I don't think it's that great, though, compared to the one that does 170, because it's just a better number to hit. It only does 130. Its ability at least makes it invulnerable to fire types, but fire types will one-shot you regardless, because they do so much damage. doesn't matter. It's not that great of a card, unfortunately. All right, we got first of all C dot, and our rare is another Regice. Regice is trolling me. We do get a Sky Pillar, which is interesting if you're you know, worried about Buzzwool. We got a Torkoal. Alright, next pack in. We got Love Disc, Spinarak, Torchic, Bagon, another Torchic, Apricot Maker, and our rare is 
explode. Um, all right, now dangerous concert is interesting. Three for eighty, and then there's thirty damage to each your opponent's bench Pokemon that already have damage on it. This could be a cool deck with Tapu Koko or even Necrozma. Who knows? Um, or it could be good with this Oricoria, which we did pull a second one out. Uh, we got Swalot. Uh, what does Torkoal actually do? I, I've heard heard some talk for this. Yeah, it's not that great. Never mind. All right. Moving down to our fourth, fourth pack remaining in the pack opening video. And uh, see, we got another Clay Doll. Not that great of a pack. All right. I'm hoping, though, again, we can pull a uh, GX. So we only got two GXs so far. And uh, we've almost opened up 20 packs. And all right, nice. We got a Secret Rare Hustle Belt. Not a terrible secret rare. I might be on the better side. I guess Acrobike is the best one to pull. But I'll take a Hustle Bell. This at least has some potential to be a pretty decent card. We got a Versal Beast Ball, which is always nice. So that was not a bad pack at all. Let's see if we can go back to back here on the GXs. Nope. We do get Aerido, so at least we pulled something that could potentially see play. You never know. And we got another 70 HP Mudkick, and that's good. So uh, here we go. Uh, 41 packs, 41 packs remaining in this pack, and uh, we'll see what we get. A bunch of new cards, wow, and another Explode. All right, we got this, This hopefully we can pull at least two to three of those. That's a really good stadium. Acrobike is nice, I guess, even though we already, you know, we already have one. Energy Recycle System is also fairly unique. Put a base energy from your pile in your hand, shuffle three. So, you know, I thought Energy Retrieval was going to kind of be the super rod kind of card, and then, you know, this card kind of comes around. But uh, we do have a Slugma, so we got two more Slugmas now, which is nice. But here we go. We got 40 packs left to open. We still have a fair amount, but if we don't start pulling more GXs. It's going to be a little worrying. Yeah, we got the new Rare Candy artwork. It's a new, nice artwork, not going to lie, but Secret Rare Candy is always going to have a place in my heart. So here we go with this next pack. All right, double rare. Can this be a Prism Star? It will not. And another... That is very annoying. We got double Mr. Mime in this pack opening. Uh, Mr. Mime. I'm not complaining. I guess it's nice to pull, um, but it's not 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 what I'm looking for. So, Mr. Mime, why you do this to me? All right, we got a Heat Ran and a Clay Doll. Heat Ran's cool. Um, it could be a nice one of in some decks. I doubt it though. Um, could be good in Magnezone, but I feel like there's just there's a way better Heat Ran. Alright, we're gonna open this next pack up. We are getting a little thin on packs, guys, so hoping we can finish off with like a few more GXs. We got the Fisherman reprint, and alright, we got the new Bayonet. Not Bayonet GX, but the new Bayonet. Alright, we're gonna open up this next pack. And alright, we'll see what we can get. Got Deoxys. Oh, nice. And it's Reverse Hollow, which is good, so now I can actually have a Reverse Hollow Deoxys. This is gonna be the nice Mewtwo replacement. And we got Deoxys Defense Form, and we got another Rainbow Energy. Pretty meh. Alright, here we go, next pack in. Can we get another GX? And that will not be, that is not, it will not be Mr. Mime. Please, please no Mr. Mimes. Got another Sogaleo. We got another Sableye at least. I don't think, I, I don't think I've actually seen a single Scyther yet. So, <laughs> there you go. Uh, we got our Underground Expedition. We got another Deoxys. We got another Lombre. I already had one. I don't even, honestly, I don't think I've seen any Lotat. I can't remember though. I don't think I've seen any Scythers yet though, so there is that. Alright, we got another Beldum, and we got Slackoth, and alright, we got a new Waylord with 228p. We could see a Waylord stall deck, you never know. Waylord stall could make a comeback in standard because of that Waylord having a lot of HP, but I doubt it. We could put bodybuilding dumbbells on it, so you never know. We got a Sneasel, and our rare is a Medicham. Okay, at least first all Sneasel is here. We got another Shrine of Punishment, which is the best card in the whole pack, I guess. Alright, 31 packs left, so... See if we can at least pull three more things. We've only one Prism Star. At least it's the one we want. We got another Ariados. We do get uh, uh, Alicia, which is a really cool card. I think this could be a one of in a few decks. The ability to get two Prism Star cards is not terrible, and I kind of like that. So, uh, we're going into our next pack. Nice! Alright, we got a Rainbow Rare Electrode. Alright, Electrode is definitely an interesting card. Um, I think it's got some potential. I don't think it's bad at all. Its ability is really good. Um, I like the ability quite a bit, and I will take it. So, alright. The pulls aren't the worst, I guess. We have been pulling a fair amount of good things. We did also get that secret hustle belt, don't forget. And, alright, next pack in. We got another Minetric. I will take that. Minetric is always good. We're going to try and pick up the pace here. Um, alright. 
Next pack in, we got Bills Maintenance and our rare is Delmize. Pretty underwhelming. Alright, here we go. 27 packs remaining, guys. We're down to 27 packs. Got another Versal Apricorn Maker. Second Cartana. Alright, not that great. Here we go. 26 packs remaining. We're almost down to 25 packs, so we're almost done. The pack opening, alright. Oh, no, we haven't played low tags. Alright, never mind. I'm done. But yeah, see, no Scyther, guys. I've not seen a single Scyther yet. I don't know, maybe I have. 25 packs, though. This is kind of like the, I would say halfway point, but it's pretty much kind of that. Alright, there we go. We got another Prism Star, and it's a Tarachi. Alright, cool. Cool. I will take it. Um, usually you end up pulling a lot more Prism Stars and pack openings like this, but only two. Alright. Maybe in, maybe we just get Latios. Oh, nice. Sceptile. Regis. Regis is annoying, but we do get the Reverse All Sceptile. Sceptile is definitely a welcomed addition to the collection. So here we go. What are we going to get in this pack? The pull rates have been picking up, I guess, after we pulled that uh, Secret Electro. Nice! We got a Stack Attacka. Definitely going to be something I'm going to be trying out. Probably going to make a Stack Attack in a Gandalf video, honestly, after this pack open video. Because I'm excited for Stack Attacka. Alright, next pack here. Can we get another GX? Back to back? Alright, no, we get a second Macargo, though. That's always nice. At least two Macargos is probably all you need. So that's good. We just got our place in Macargos in a way. We got Rainbow Brush, and we got Kyogre. Kyogre's interesting. I'm not going to lie, it could be a decent one of in Waterbox. Dual Splash isn't terrible. I think Kyogre could be a one of in Waterbox right now. Uh, we do have Rainbow Brush. Choose energy attached to one of your Pokemon. Should check for basic energy and switch it with that. This is nice. I'm not going to lie. This could open up a few archetypes to be kind of a thing. You never know. All right, but we got 20 packs left, guys. 20 packs. So this is the end point. We got another Rainbow Brush. And we got another Grumpig. 19 packs. <laughs> you know, at least we've been picking up the GXs here at the end. Double Mudkips. My boy. And we got another Bayonet. That's back-to-back -back Bayonet. It's not that great of a card. We don't need that many Bayonets. But Double Mudkip is always appreciated. We just... Okay, we got our place there. Alright, here we go. Let's try to get at least two more GXs. I'm hoping for a Rayquaza GX. I don't even know if I'll make a Rayquaza video in all honesty. But, uh, we'll see. We got... Okay. That's a pretty bad pack. I mean, Registeel is a cool card, not gonna lie, but... Wasn't that great of a pack. Alright, here we go. We got a Versal Acrobite. That's pretty nice. Third Macargo. Okay, well. There you go. I don't think Chill Macargo will ever be a thing in decks, but... At least we have three Macargos now. We got more Slugmas, which now we, well, we got more of the full playset. And our rare is Tyranitar. Alright. Now, this could be a very funny card... Um, I was looking at a Japan website, and I saw a Tyranitar Electrode GX deck. So, I don't know. Flip a coin for each bench Pokemon. Stack to 6 damage to that Pokemon. If he had heads. Not that great of an attack, but it could be a fun attack. You never know. You never know. It's interesting. Just doing 62 bench Pokemon is not something to laugh at. Oh, nice. Versal Slugma's great. And we got a Salamence. Salamence one of my favorite Pokemon. Not that great of a card, though. It's Pokemon's reactive. Your opponent switches. You know, not that great. Reversal Slugma might be the best card in the whole pack. Alright, we got 14 packs left. So, this is almost the end of the road. We got another Tyranitar and another Slacking. Okay, not bad. Not bad at all. The only sad thing with Slacking is you can't combo with Dawn Wings. Um, but... You never know. I think Slacking could be interesting. We got another uh, Versal Rainbow Brush. And a Grumpig. <laughs> got a Pelipper. And before Pelipper becomes the new tech to beat Falk. I'm just kidding. But if it was a water type, I could see Pelipper being okay against Falk. Okay, here we go. Will we get another Prism Star? We do not. We get a Swamper, though. That's our first one. That's pretty nice. We got 11 packs left. Almost down to 10 packs. We are almost out of packs here, guys. This is it. Okay, we got a second Electrode. That's not bad, I guess. I doubt Electro GX will be the first, the second deck I make, but it's always appreciated. We got Tropius, and we got another Ludicolo. All right, I will take that. Um, you know, find a friend. It's basically a worse version of Beacon because it needs energy, but it's on a Pokemon more HP. Here we go. We got nine packs remaining. I'm hoping we can at least pull one more GX. You never know. We got another Sceptile. That's always appreciated. 
looking for one more GX, guys. Can we pull oh, at least one more GX? This is going to be the end of the line. Got another verse hall. Shup it. Okay, come on. I'm hoping for a GX, guys. I'm, I wasn't honestly let down. This is honestly one of the better pack openings I've done in a long time. All right, Prism Star. Another Jirachi. Um, you know, if that was Latios, that'd be nice. But it's not. I'll take it, though. That's technically still another good rare card to pull, so that's good. And we got Versal Hunter. We got a... Oh, my gosh. This Deoxys can go off. Go away. Trico. Okay, we got ten of those. Never mind. I was thinking we didn't have it, but it's five packs left, guys. We got five packs left. This is basically the end of the pack opening video. Another Clay Doll. We got our second Reverse Hall Fampy. The new Dawn Fan is a pretty interesting card, not gonna lie. I don't think it's great, but I think it's interesting. And okay, we got Bill's Maintenance. Nice! Alright, we got a Shiftry GX. That is always appreciated. Shiftry is a good card. Three packs left. Can we pull uh, another GX? You never know. I doubt it, but uh, you know what? Just a thought that counts. Two packs, guys. Two packs. This is it. This is it, guys. We got two packs remaining. And our rare is Reggie Steel. Alright, last pack of the pack opening. Can we end it off with a GX? Preferably Rayquaza Kappa. Nope. Manetric, though. Alright, and we got Reverse Hall Light. Okay. Manetric is appreciated, I guess. So, overall, not the worst pack opening. I'm actually kind of happy with what I got. I think my pulls were pretty good. We got, you know, we got Shiftry. Uh, we got two Electrodes. Unfortunately, we got... Technically, we did get two of the worst GXs. Two Electrodes. Two Mr. Mimes. The Mr. Mimes are very annoying because it's not that great of a card. Um, other than that, you know, the GXs weren't bad. We got another uh, Full Art Scizor. You know, we at least got Laddie Ass Prism Star, which is always good. Uh, we got Full Art Scizor. We got a Stack Attacka. That was a good pull. That uh, Reverse Hollow... Or, not Reverse Hollow. Uh, Rainbow Rare um, Hustle Belt. It's also a pretty nice pull in my eyes. So yeah, not a bad pack opening video. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to leave it a like. And also, make sure to subscribe to help me on the road to 3k subs. Again, if you're not already subscribed to the channel, help me hit 3k subs. Hope you guys enjoyed this pack opening video. I'm pretty pretty happy with the pulls I got. And I'll catch you guys in another PGCGO video very soon. Probably on Stack Attack, so catch you guys later. Have a good day.